What's good, Fight Fans? Dash is corner. And I so want to see this fight. <laughs> this is this fight right here is supposed to be in the works right now. Okay? It's supposed to be in the works. All right? I think... Uh, I think uh, Bunny is the one who said that it was uh, that they were already sitting down at the table and trying to work out out a fight in between him and Mikey Garcia. Now I have to say that I like Mikey Garcia in this fight, okay, for a couple of different reasons. All right, I think that Robert Easter Jr. is a very good fighter. Okay, I'm not gonna disrespect him in this video, okay, at all. What I'm going to say, though, is exactly how I feel, okay? And I feel that even though he has the height and the reach um, advantage in this fight against Mikey Garcia, Mikey Garcia has the power and the experience, okay? I think... Mikey Garcia is too strong for uh, Robert Easter Jr. Um, Robert Easter Jr. is very tall. He's a very slim guy. He's a very slim guy, okay? And uh, Mikey Garcia is a very hard puncher. A lot of people don't give him credit for his punching power, okay? But certain fighters have said the hardest punch they ever felt came from Mikey Garcia. Okay, in sparring and actual fights, the guy can hit. Uh, I think uh, Brandon Rio said it was a body punch. It was the hardest punch he's ever felt in his life. Came from Mikey Garcia. Um, Marcus Mandana, same. Uh, they sparred a few times, and Marcus Mandana's bigger. He was always bigger than Mikey Garcia, and he said Mikey Garcia hits hard. Like, the hardest he's ever been hit was from Mikey Garcia. So the guy has punching power, Okay. Now, I understand that um, Robert Easter Jr. is supposed to have been working on something different and uh, as far as training camp, and he's supposed to know how to use his reach now. Like, that's what he's supposed to be doing his up-and-coming fights now. But what I say to that is everybody has a plan until they get hit. Um, when he fought for Tuna, it seemed like when he, when he could or when he was trying to keep him at bay with that long jab and keep him in the reach, but for Tuna got in. And when that happened and he got hit a couple times, he resorted to what he knows, what he likes doing, what he's comfortable doing. And that's fighting in the phone booth. You know what I'm saying? It's using that expression, I mean that, you know, the shoulder roll and, you know, fighting like he's the same height as his competitor, as the person that he's fighting. And regardless of if he's working on that or not, just like I said, Mike Garcia is a strong puncher. And I'm more than sure he can get inside at least once. I think if he feels the power, I mean, you have everybody's a plan until they get hit. If, if Robert Easter feels that power, I think his plan, I mean, his corner might be telling him one thing, but when you're in that fight, it's a totally different story. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think that um, Mikey Garcia is going to stop Robert Easter Jr. if they fight. Uh, a lot of people probably think I'm crazy. Some people might agree. But at the same time, I mean, it is what it is. What it is you know what I'm saying? That's, that's, that's just what I think. Um, to the body, I don't think that he can take punches to the body from Mikey Garcia. And Mikey Garcia is not a big body puncher, but, I mean, he got a lot of torso to aim at, and he's the shorter fighter. But, I mean, all in all, I really just hope this fight happens soon, probably next for this, for uh, Mikey Garcia. Um I really hope this fight happens. It's going to be very entertaining. Uh, it's too close to say exactly what will happen. But in my opinion, when I look at both of these fighters, I see Robert Easter getting stopped. But um, maybe he puts up a very competitive fight. Maybe uh, Mikey Garcia imposes his will and his power in the beginning of the fight. And it's totally out of whack, and he looks horrible. But at the same time, you got to respect it. It's a unification. But uh, let me know who you guys got for this fight if it does happen next. Hopefully it happens next. But always like and subscribe to the channel. Peace.